In what was the first ever matchup between Arizona State and Grand Canyon in softball, the Sun Devils' offense exploded, scoring 21 runs in what was a dominant 21 0 win over the Lopes. I think it's great that we came out and scored that many runs, and I think it's very important to like never give up and like don't shut down early. And I think it's great that we jumped on them so quick, and I think it was a big momentum thing. Like, once one of us got a hit, it just kept on rolling down the lineup. So it was great to see everybody contribute to this game. The second inning set the program record for most runs in an inning when 13 runs were put on the board. Catcher Maddie Hackbarth notched her 15th home run of the season, putting her five homers away from the program's single season record. While infielder Hallie Harger had a bases clearing double, and sophomore Alina Torres capped off the inning with a three run bomb. Wait, wait on it. I'm still not trying to think about it as. As much, I feel like um, I'll know when I get close to it, um, uh, when I get to whatever, 19, 20, uh, I think I'll start feeling it a little bit more, but happy to get another one on the board. Yes, the offense was dominant, but so was the pitching. Freshman Allison Royalty was lights out, allowing just one hit and striking out nine batters in the run rule victory. I guess the game went on and she saw more runs get on the board. I think she got a little bit more comfortable in the circle. Um, when you have long innings like that, you, you need to make sure that you're staying warm and staying loose in the bullpen. I think she did a really good job doing that. Next step for the Sun Devils is a three-game set against a 22-8 Stanford team who have lost four games in a row. In Tempe, Zachary Larson, Inferno Intel.